San Diego County bars and restaurants. They are starting to reopen after unexpected closures during the holidays. Our ABC 10 reporter John Horn explains why the decision to reopen is a tough one. We have a really great local regular clientele that comes in. Whistle stop bartender Chelsea Roop says her regulars are like family. So she's glad to be opened back up after the bar did something once unthinkable close over the Christmas holiday. We wanted to play everything as safe as possible. Uh, we had some staff that contracted the COVID virus and, you know, we didn't want to put our customers or guests at risk. San Diego bars and restaurants already short staffed have been hit even harder with the spread of the Omicron variant. Workers are calling out due to possible exposure or positive tests, forcing voluntary closures. In La Jolla, the Piatti restaurant has extended a closure that began before New Year's Day to the 13th, while the Marine Room will keep its doors shut until the 12th. The question all have to ask is, when is the right time to reopen? We're back up and running. We're fully staffed again. Everybody's back. They're, you know, healthy and happy. At Kensington's Cucina Sorella, executive chef Tim Kalenko says the restaurant turned the lights back on Wednesday after a week-long closure due to positive tests among its staff of 10 to 15. Still, he says the restaurant isn't out of the woods. Are you concerned that you might have to close it down again? Very. Um, but so far, again, everybody's healthy. We're, we're taking all the safety protocols very seriously. We're following all the directives. Kolenko says restaurants tend to hit a lull with the holidays over. So being short staffed now is less impactful on operations. John Horn, ABC 10 News. And as of November, about 125,000 San Diegans worked in our county bars and restaurants. That, however, is down about 10% from pre-pandemic levels.